Hi, I'm Coach Mick, and I'd like to welcome you to video number seven of our 10-part series on the serve. And this video is titled The Acceleration Stage. Now, the simple, efficient tennis solution for you is just push up and out. So if you think that simply, you'll be in pretty good shape. But you'll see in the videos here, a few things do take place right after that cocking stage. And that's right where we store this energy, like pulled that slingshot back all the way back and we're ready to release. And a couple things you're gonna see is the legs and the hips are just driving up, number one. Number two, you're gonna start to see this uncoiling from your trunk, and that includes your abs and your chest or shoulders are gonna start uncoiling up into the ball. Very, very important. And then you're gonna see your head and your chest, like we said, driving up. You know, one simple quick tip here is just as you're doing this, keep your chin up in this stage. If you start to drive your chin down in this stage, everything's gonna start coming down. So keep your chin up as you're going through the acceleration stage so you can get your racket accelerating up into contact with the tennis ball. Now the acceleration stage, number seven here, can be, it's almost interlinked with the cocking stage, but one thing you'll see here in the cocking stage is you can still see that she's sideways a little bit, and that's where she really starts to whip around with her core right there first, followed by her chest, and then followed by her elbow, and then followed by her racket right there. And that's what we call the acceleration stage. Now the head and the chest, if you look at this, you know, she's driving everything still going up into the ball. She's still really reaching up high into that tennis ball for sure. And she should concentrate on doing this through contact. But you can see how, once again, in this stage, she really starts to, if we rewind this a little bit, real, there's the cocking stage right there. So that's before everything just starts to happen. And the acceleration stage is between the cocking stage and contact. And that's where, again, this comes around. Now her chest comes around. Now her elbow's coming up. And then her hand. And then finally, you're going to see her racket face make contact. And that's going to be our next stage. Now the simple, efficient tennis solution in the acceleration stage is just push up and out. So keep it simple like that. This is where that all starts, pushing up and out. But you'll see the same thing when it comes to his serve, where you're going to see him start to push up with his, his hip. All right, right here. And we'll fix that right there, his hip and his trunk and his shoulders and his elbow, and then eventually his forearm, and then his racket, and that's right before contact. And that's what we're looking for, is that uncoiling stage by stage. All right, and it's, and it's important that you're uncoiling from the bottom up because we're transferring that energy up. But his hip right here, you're gonna see, is gonna start to lock. This is where, all right, you see his hip here, it's going up. And right here, it's going to start to lock. And that's going to be very important because that is really going to help get his racket head accelerating through the ball. And it, it, it'd be the same in, in baseball. If you were to step with your right foot and throw, you'll feel that it's a lot of work with the arm. But if you keep that right foot back, you're going to see how your arm is going to accelerate a little bit more. And this is where that starts. Now the quick tip, you can even add a quick tip in here. You can say, keep your chin up. It's important that it keeps that chin up. If he lets that chin drop or come down too early, then his racket starts to come down too early. But if he keeps that chin up and keeps it going this way, it's going to be easier for his racket to travel in the same direction. So the acceleration stage is just that stage between the cocking stage and actually contact and how everything starts to uncoil into the ball. Well, I hope you enjoyed the videos. And as you can see with both stances, that acceleration stage is right where your racket really starts to move, even though your legs are really the start, all right? of getting all this kinetic energy going, it's this stage where everything starts whipping around. And if you're doing things properly, all of that energy up to now is driving up into contact from your legs to your hips 
to your chest and shoulders and now up into contact through your arm and that's going to be our next stage finally called the contact stage. So I hope you enjoyed today's video on the acceleration stage and remember for more tips and instruction you can always go to realtennisnetwork.com. Hi, it's Coach Mick, and if you enjoyed this video, then I'm sure that you will enjoy my free step-by-step -step serving progression guide that includes all 10 progressions of the serve with accompanying illustrations, a simple explanation of each stage for those of you just starting out, and a more detailed explanation for those of you who are more advanced, all in bullet form. Now, below each illustration, there is a clickable link that will take you directly to the video post of each specific stage, showing you some of the top players in the world going through these same exact progressions. This guide will put all 10 stages of the serve in one convenient location for you, so you do not have to go search around on the site or the internet for each individual stage. And if you'd like to download the free guide, you can do so by clicking the link to the side or beneath this video. And remember that if you have any questions, please email me at mick at realtennisnetwork.com. <music>